extension manager in, inside of Dreamweaver CS4 and show you what we can do with it. Um, over here it says extend Dreamweaver and I selected browse for web widgets before I started the tutorial. And once you do that you're taken to the Adobe website and you can uh, select any extension you want. I, I chose the Thickbox Gallery and if I come back here to Dreamweaver and go to insert on the bottom it says uh, TCN uh, widgets thick box gallery and that's why I select it and when I do that I get these two thumbnails these are my two images and this is the coding um, if I go to a live view and I hit one of the images that's what's supposed to happen um, and you'll get the larger image um, but let's do this let's insert our own image what I did was I already copied the uh, line of coding that I needed I'm gonna paste it in and select let me do this. I'll, I'll just show you what you can do. I'm going to put it on the uh, next line over. Drop it down a bit. Um, so you can see already, you can do what you want with the coding and positioning. Um, and that's my image that I took. And let's bring this up here. And close that. Live view. It's closed. Save. And show you actually what it looks like. So there you go. It's a working uh, thumbnail to large image uh, gallery. Um, but to, in order to get to this uh, stage, I'm going to minimize this and show you what the actual um, extension does for you. Once you insert the extension into uh, your document, and you're going to probably be doing this on your own website if you're using this, you're going to get three folders. You're going to get the CSS folder, the images folder, and the scripts folder. Well, with the images folder, I renamed my image based on what they did already. Um, for example, they uh, named one of the images Thickbox Demo underscore uh, IMG1. Um, so I gave the same name for my image and I just put a 3 at the end. And same thing with the thumb. They inserted it and put thumb and I just uh, put the number 3 at the end. And then if I split and I come to the coding here, you're going to see that's where the line of coding is here. So basically what I did was I just copied this block of coding over here. Um, and I changed the number to three um, and it's that easy and then once you see the communication going on you're manually you know through HTML uh, communicating with the images in your local folder and it's very simple to use and uh, what it delivers is a very uh, sleek picture gallery um, they have other galleries that I played around with and they're very nice um, so I would highly recommend to anybody to use uh, the extensions for uh, Dreamweaver CS4